What's up, guys? This is gonna be a very distracting shot because you can see Charlie right there sleeping, being cute as hell. Maybe I shouldn't have said anything. I was going through my YouTube channel and I was looking at old videos that I'd done in the past. And I came across this one. It was titled, I made a custom Siri AI using my own voice, vocal cloning. Now I shot this video in June of 2018, almost exactly three years ago. In the world we're in today, technology is evolving so fast. And so I wanna revisit this idea. In fact, I want to revisit this program. The program that I used in this video was called Liarbird. To my understanding, that company has either evolved or been acquired by a different company called Descript or Descript. Probably Descript. <laughs> I think one of the craziest things today is that there's these things called deep fakes. Basically, they could take somebody's face, like a celebrity's face, and put it on anybody's body and like control the face so it looks like them. In the future, they're going to be able to get celebrities to visually endorse a product, even though that celebrity has no idea that this even exists. So deep fakes is a very visual thing. Today, what we're doing is a thing called vocal cloning. Now, I haven't really messed around with Descript all that much, and we're going to test it out. We're going to try to make a new custom Siri voice, but I want to see if the computer computer can make it sound like me. You know what I mean? Here we have a uh, descript. Hello. My name is Dan and I like to play hockey and eat pickles. <laughs> and in here you could select your overdub voice. So we're going to use Malcolm. Okay. Hello. My name is Dan and I like to play hockey and eat pickles. Way better. Like way better already than the other one. There still is that sort of robotic tone, you know, like, hello, my name is Dan and I like to play hockey and eat pickles. Hi, 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 boobies, chocolate, and carrots. Hi, 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 boobies, chocolate, and carrots. <laughs> what we're gonna do today is we're gonna do vocal cloning. We're gonna go through the, the motions and we're gonna record my voice and we're gonna have it do this, okay? We're gonna click overdub at the side. We're gonna go in the top right, it says create new voice. So if we go up here and we go open script, it brings us to their website. Now on their website, there are, there's the main script, there's supplement number one and supplement number two. The main script, when you click this, it is a 30 minute script. However, if you want, you can stop after 10 minutes. But if you do that, you'll get a little bit more of a rough outcome. The only thing that's slightly creepy, I will say, is at the start, it says, I, the owner of the voice you are listening to right now, give consent to the script to create an overdub voice of this voice based on the project media contained in this Descript project. What's freaky is that once your voice is created, you can actually share access to it. Anyone with whom the owner shares access will be able to generate speech that sounds like this voice. This is an important part, guys. You're basically saying when your voice is created, it's gonna sound like you and you can actually grant other people access to your voice, which like deep fakes can be a dangerous thing because they can make phone calls under your voice. One of the biggest indicators and identity traits that we have is our voice and how we sound and how we talk. So what we have here is it's a script from Planet Earth 2, I believe. Like, like you're going to talk about a polar bear stirs, wolves, packs of them, 8 to 10 strong, you know? Now, this is going to take you 30 minutes. I'm going to make myself some tea. We are going to go through this. We're going to see if it actually takes 30 minutes and then submit it. A hundred years ago, there were one and a half billion people on Earth. Now, over six billion proudies, but lemurs. From a single ancestor, about a hundred different first, types of The smallest of the three is still bigger than whales. The largest lemur seldom comes down from the branches. All the world's great broad waterfalls are only found in the lower courses of this these This island rivers. in Indonesia, home to dragons, 10 feet long and massive. And these, these are the longest where rivers these meet are the, the sea. Largest. Crab-eating monkeys are mangrove specials, racer snake, but others are waiting in ambush. Like that takes a lot, that takes longer than I thought. Okay, so we've read the entire 30 minute script. We're now gonna go here. We're gonna submit our file. The program is now transcribing what I just spoke out. And there it is, okay. The leopard symbolizes the fragility of our natural heritage. Ooh, this is pretty good. So once you have your script loaded in, I said, I think you hit, you hit submit training data. And now we wait. It says it's gonna take anywhere between 12 to 24 hours and they will email you once your overdub voice is ready. I hope this is done today. It's still the morning, so there's a good chance it can be. We'll come back. A little later. I got the email, I got the email. So it only took about four hours. We go into our voices now, and now it says voice Dan, one style. <laughs> I'm so curious if it sounds robotic like the last one. I hope not. Hello, my name is Dan Roto, and this is not my real voice. This is a recording. I'm gonna say it with my voice now. Hello. My name is Dan Roto, and this is not my real voice. This is a recording that was cloned to sound just like the real Dan. Kind of freaky, isn't it? Oh, my name is Dan Roto, and this is not my real voice. Ooh. This is a recording that was cloned to sound just like the real Dan. Kind of freaky, isn't it? <laughs> thing that was cloned to sound just like the real Dan. Kind of freaky, isn't it? It is freaky. Hello, Hello my, my name is Dan Roto, and, and this is not my real voice. voice. This, this is a recording that was cloned to sound just like the real dead. Kind, kind of freaky, isn't it? 
That is way better than the original one. Today is going to be the day that they're going to throw it back to you. Today is going to be the day that they're going to throw it back to you. Oh, that shit was close. Charlie, do you want to go for a walk, my little noodle butt? Charlie, do you want to go for a walk, my little noodle butt? Oh my God. The only thing I could say is that it, it still has that sort of bricky sort of like you know, talking patterns. Like, Charlie, do you want to go for a walk, my little noodle butt? Like, you can you can sort of hear the robotics in there still. My little noodle butt. My little noodle butt. Let me try to copy it. My little noodle butt. My little noodle butt. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> okay, so one of the other cool things is if you go and say, hello, my name is Dan, and I would love if you subscribe to my YouTube channel and share this video. Oh, that was weird. Now, what I can do is I can actually change this and go to... Now, under Dawn, you can actually change the way he says things. So you can make it angry, you can make it scared, you can make it disgusted. So this is neutral Dawn saying what I said. Hello, my name is Dan, and I would love if you subscribe to my YouTube channel and share this video. He made it like the movie trailer voice, you know? Okay, so you can now go from that and change it to angry. Hello, my name is Dan, and I would love if you subscribe to my YouTube channel and share this video. Okay, <laughs> let's try sad. What would sad sound like? Hello, my name is Dan, and I would love if you subscribe to my YouTube channel and share this video. God, so like sort of whispery. Compared to three years ago, the voice has come a long way. It actually sounds like me. However, it's still sort of like blocky between words. I would say this does sound like me. In fact, it sounds a lot more like me than before. Second, it's really cool that I could type things out and have myself read it or I could choose somebody else to read it in a different emotion. And lastly, I think this is really a good tool for transcribing. Like YouTube has a transcribing feature on here, but I think if you want visuals, this will actually sort of do that for you. So guys, I mean, if you guys want to try it out, the, the, the program's called Descript. There is a free seven day trial, which is what I'm using. However, you do have to enter in a credit card, but if you cancel it before that, I don't believe you get charged. I don't know. It is a program you download and it is a program that will take your credit card info at the start. So just want to put that out there so you guys aren't like shocked and be like, oh, what the hell? I thought it was free. Yes, actually, you know what? We're going to end We're gonna end the video with voice dub me. So that's the video, guys. I'm going to throw it over to voice dub Dan to end this video, but thank you. Oh, I'm, I almost did it. Oh my God. See, what is this? Like, I'm an anime character? <laughs> thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. Please subscribe to my channel if you haven't yet. And I will see you in my next video. Later, guys.